Hey, what's up YouTube? Today, I'm gonna be installing my Pulsar tuner for my Hemi. I got a 2019 Ram 1500 5.7. Real simple, actually. There's the computer right there. You just unplug those two plugs with the red clip on it. Plug this into the computer and replacement. And plug yours back in there. Let's give it a go. Alright guys, first I want to give it a good go at a normal 0 to 60. So, we'll get out here on this road real quick. Sixteenths. Take out your old screws. You're gonna be replacing them to get longer ones to fit through the uh, tuner. Uh, these, I believe, are a 10 millimeter head. So, let's see how that goes. All right. So, like I said, it's pretty simple. Just slide in the new uh, bolts in. Connect your plug. Make sure you put the thing on the same side. I think they should. I'm going to go in a little bit. Just make sure to keep track of that. Slide it in. Push the tab down. Good to go. One thing I did forget to mention was you do want to uh, make sure you disconnect your uh, negative battery terminal before you start. I believe it says in the instructions, but yeah, just don't skip that step. It's pretty important. All right, we're about to give it a go back on the road. I'll tell you already, just since it took off, after starting it, I already feel it more responsive. So, get on the 0 to 60 here, and go. Alright, we're going to give it a go again, round two. Uh, I'm not sure if I actually saved the settings last time. It, is, it did feel different, but we'll see again. I'm going to try to stop here. 0 to 60. So yeah, that one was a noticeable difference. Had a little bit of a tire screech on takeoff. Um, it did feel a lot more pulled when I get up and go there. So um, I watched another video about uh, uh, performance on the dyno with this Pulsar tuner and uh, it actually showed uh, about 50 more horsepower so I don't have a dyno here but I can definitely feel the difference for what that's worth uh, it also gives you the option in here to uh, change the tire size so I uh, updated my tire size the factory comes with 31 inch tires uh, I put on some 33s so uh, had to update that. I did notice that my uh, miles per hour was slightly off. Uh, with those couple inch difference in tires. Uh, now it actually looks right on. So uh, yeah, it is a fix for that if you need to uh, uh, change tires and sizes. Uh, it worked well. All right, so it's actually pretty cool. It comes with eight different levels. Um, it says for seven and eight for performance, it's recommended at least 91 octane. Uh, but yeah, you control it through the menu here on the screen setup. You go into setup, and then you want to go to the center one, and that's the one where you control it from. 